babe so today's video i will be doing another review for janet collection now the wig that i will be reviewing is the zara wig she is from the natural me collection and this is how she looks so if you ladies want to know all the tea when it comes to zara Stay tuned. Okay, ladies, so I did receive Zara in the color 1B. She do come in other colors, such as a 1, 2, a 51, 99J, and it looks like she is in a ombre 1B slash 30. So this wig is 100% premium fiber it is a deep part lace wig and it's pretty much like a front tool so you do have coverage from ear to ear so if you want to you know lay this wig down with some glue or some got to be free spray you definitely can so i'm gonna go ahead and take her out of the packaging hopefully you ladies can see this this is her stock card as always janet collection always package day wigs very well you do have a hair net over her now this is how zara looks straight out of the pack the curls are a little tight. This is the lace and this is the parting space that you do get. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn her inside out. You do have a comb in the nape area as well as two adjustable straps. You do have two combs right here in the front and this is how much parting space you do get. I am gonna take my tweezers and open up the part to give it a more natural look. So I'm going to go ahead and take my Ebon Lace Tint in the shade Light Warm Brown and I'm just going to go ahead and spray my part. And I'm just going to pop baby girl on my head. Y'all, I look like Shanene. <laughs> okay, see the combs is going to be a problem for me because it's snagging on my braids. And that is going to be annoying. So I will be taking them combs out. You know, I do like her. I like the, the curl pattern. Um, now, I am a side part girl. I love wearing my wigs on a side part. So I do not know if I'm going to keep her in the middle. But I am going to go ahead and cut this lace off the wig. And I'll be back. Okay guys, so I did go ahead and cut the lace off the wig and I also shift the wig to the to the side a little bit. And I also went in and sprayed a little bit of the lace tint some more on the part. You guys, if you guys are using any type of lace tint, just be mindful of your clothes because I did get it on my shirt. I'm not sure if it's picking up on camera or not. I don't know. I like how she looked like this already. My probably just... These combs is gonna be a nuisance. So I'm probably gonna end up taking them out. I am going to go ahead and cut out some baby hairs. Who chow. Y'all, I'm not even gonna pull this all the way out. Cause I feel like it's starting to tangle up on me. Oh yeah, it's tangling up on me. Y'all see that? Oh my god. All I want is some baby hairs.
final look of this wig turned out I did go ahead and redo my baby hairs I wasn't feeling how um, the baby hairs turned out of me using the hair I feel like it didn't give it a natural look so I did go ahead and pull out my own little baby hairs and it gives it more of a natural vibe um, that got to be glue be working for real I do love the curl pattern of this wig I love how she's just so nice and full and she really mimics your natural hair I do feel like this wig is definitely for the ladies who are thinking of transitioning and they don't know how they will look with natural hair and I feel like it's also for the ladies who haven't got to this fullness of the fro and you want to see how it will finally look when you do reach this goal i feel like this wig will be perfect for you ladies y'all it's very lightweight my head don't feel hot i don't feel like i got a lot of hair on my head i did go in and as y'all can see i did go in and cut the wig a little bit to kind of give it some type of shape going on but i can't wait to try zara in some other colors like i said this wig is really pretty now I would not suggest that is a pop on and go type of wig you do have to do some work to her just a little bit and once you you know you finesse the wig she will look really bomb now this wig does retail for under $30 like I did mention I will also leave some links down below in the description box so you ladies who want to purchase Zara you will be able to purchase her I feel like for me wigs like this more so looks better on me with a side part I pretty much tend to go to side parts anyhow when it comes to most of my wigs when I was running my hands through the hair I didn't really notice any type of shedding or any type of tangling the only tangling that I did receive was in the front when I tried to separate the hair to make to cut some hairs to do some baby hairs but that's the only type of tangling that I did receive when I do touch the wig it, it gives me that soft but rough vibe I don't know how to explain it I can say it does mimics natural hair very well this would be like a 4c texture this would definitely be like my texture for sure. I cannot wait till my hair actually get this full. This wig does give me that braid out feel. But overall, I really do love Zara, y'all. She is really cute. She's really stylish. And I think Zara is going to be my go-to wig for the winter. But that is going to be it for now. If you ladies enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button as well as hit that subscribe button. And make sure you ladies turn on your post notifications so when I do drop videos, you guys won't miss it but that is going to be all that i have for today i hope you guys stay safe and stay blessed peace